Hey guys, today I will be basically showing you a free draw tutorial so we can make things like this. Or this. Or this. You can make basically anything you want once you can do these things. Like, actually. You can make tons of things. For example, you can make this thing for from BFB. Hold up. Okay, so we have four right here from BFB. Yes. So you can draw basically everything and you follow these simple steps. Okay, so let's say you have a... Let's say you have this. Okay, so when you make this, so you think, wow, this isn't that bad, but there are multiple things you can do. You need to take advantage to, of your layers, because if you don't, then I'll just say it doesn't go great. So, you need to make an inside model. So, like, you need to actually fill it in. Even if it's, like, not really have much color, trust me. If you put color in, then it's going to work really well for you. Because, well, you know, like, the teeth, how they aren't colored in? Well, when you color the background, that's going to get colored the background, too. And you don't want that. So first, now that we have that out of the way, we can actually start the tips. Well, more tips. There's like some ads in the background. Okay, so now we have this. So if you want to have decent art, you're going to need shading. Shading is really good when you have things like these, because it, make it makes it look a lot more detailed. Like, I made this in literally like less than two minutes. Here are some things you can do once you really have more time to get the tips. So you see these layers? When you use those, instead of like, okay, so let's say you're like, I'm going to use red. Now I'm going to add yellow. Huh? What's happening? That's because you didn't use any layers. Like, look. See, now it doesn't combine at all. But that's not all to it. It can get a lot more complex. Like, look, you could even make the most simplistic things look detailed. Literally, you can make things like this in a matter of seconds. It doesn't take very long. You can make even be more creative too. 
just slowly get darker. But yes. Now that we have that out of the way, I'll show you some things that you can actually do with this. Hey Jax, I think the cat's in your Wendy's bag. Okay, so we fill this up. There's like a ton of things you can do. I don't think I'll show that. There's also a lot more tips that you can do. Like, for example, you could, uh, oh yeah, if you don't know, there's actually this line button that makes your things into actual lines. Pretty good at object show stuff. So, I think you should just So let's remove this arm. And look, you already have decent things. But always when you draw, make sure to follow the rules, or just not to try to troll people, because it's really annoying when that happens. Okay, so we have like this little drawing. And look, when you get really detailed, you can add like a background too. So like Whoa, I don't want it this high. Actually oh yeah, another thing. When you have a background, you want to make sure it's behind all of the layers so it goes under everything. Okay, so now you need to fill the background up. But then, next you need to do the floor. And as always, you want to fill up the white as much as you can. Otherwise, it's kind of not going to go that well for you. As you can see, it's like a magician. Okay, so yes, we have that filled. And we also need this filled because... What to say, we kind of can't have a mouth that isn't colored in. Well, you can, it's just harder. Like, a lot harder. So now you need the wood floor. Well, you don't need it. It depends on what you're actually drawing.
Okay, so now we have the base picture. But before you finish, you need to add the extra detail. That's always going to blow people away. Literally, I get compliments for this art. We have the base picture, and you know what you want to do? You need to save it. So, Magician Squarey. Look, look, this person is going to compliment my, ar my art, literally. They're going to compliment it. Very good. See, I literally get compliments for doing my art. <laughs> okay, actually, I didn't write that. Over your mouse over it. Cool. Thanks. It's not really that hard to draw for me, but I can see how it can be harder for some other people. Okay, so. You really need to be, like, complex with your lines. Look, actually, you need to be really complex with your lining. Otherwise, it's not going to turn out the way you want it to. Unless, if you're being really complex, then I guess you could do it like that. But, like, you need to know the order that you're going to do it. And honestly, for me, it takes way too long. So these are like the stage lights. And you have talent, my man. Thank you. This is my second compliment. Like actually, people really like my art. Okay, so, look, like, actually, you always need to be careful with your lines. If you don't, then you are going to mess up in doing the, like, correct use of... You know, the correct use of what you call it. correct use or the best most beneficial use of the what you call it yeah of the want okay. so yeah 
we're pretty much done. Here's the final result. And... Okay, so now we have the top bar of the white. So this is the final result. I hope you guys like it. And... Magician Squarey. And... Just the basic stuff. Also, maybe an episode of the second season will be a talent show. So, sneak peeks? Maybe. See you guys next time. Bye-bye.